Welcome to Kellyanne Cares, a -a one-of-a-kind show created to motivate, stimulate, educate, and inspire you personally and professionally. Hi, I'm Kelly. I'm an entrepreneur, patient advocate, content creator, and author. You may know me from the Everything is Messy book, brand, and podcast, but what you may not know is how hard I had to work to get me to where I am today mentally, physically, emotionally, and spiritually. I'm a firm believer that everything happens for a reason. And in this season, I'm more driven and extremely passionate about my purpose to help you save the time, money, and energy it takes to be happier and get healthier with your mind, body, business, and life. Tune in every week to hear raw, unfiltered conversations from myself and my incredible guests as we discuss trending topics, share stories of resilience, and chat about all things health, wealth, healing, and wellness. Whether you're here to listen, learn, or laugh, I promise to bring awareness and add more value to your day. Take this time to relax and recharge. Listen, life is short. Invest in yourself. Be loud. Be different. Be you. And most importantly, enjoy the ride. Buckle up because today's podcast experience starts now. One more thing. Sharing is caring. I would love your thoughts on today's episode. Head on over to Apple Podcasts to rate, review, and subscribe. I would truly appreciate it. Want to continue the conversation? Let's connect online. You can find me at kellyangorman.com and all my social links are in the show notes. Now let's get into today's show. When things go wrong as they sometimes will, when the road you're trudging seems all uphill, when the funds are low and the depths are high and you want to smile, but you have to sigh, when care is pressing you down a bit, rest if you must, but don't you quit. Life is queer with its twists and turns as everyone every one of us sometimes learns and many a failure turns about when he might have won he stuck it out don't give up though the pace seems slow you may succeed with another blow success is failure turned inside out the silver tint of the clouds of doubt and you can never tell how close you are it may be near when it seems so far so stick to the fight when you're the hardest hit it's when things seem worse that you must not quit. That poem is by John Greenleaf Whittier. It's titled Don't Quit. And this episode is so important for me to share today because I've been MIA for just about two months. And I love this poem. It's also in my book at the very end. And I'm here to share so much with you today. And I'm so excited. I'm in my new recording studio, aka a vehicle. And I'm still in Las Vegas. A lot of you have been asking me. And before we get started, I just want to share with you that today's episode is brought to you by GetUpsideRepurpose.io and Fetch Rewards. Please make sure you check the show notes for all of those links because I'm here to save you as much time, money, and energy as I possibly can. And those three tools, whether you use them in business and life, will do just that. So now, where have I been for two months? First of all, I've been sick. I've been sick of this shit, like that audio on TikTok. I've been so sick of being sick, and I feel like I've been sick for a year. I also feel like this is part of my healing journey, so I'm just taking it one day at a time. I've been talking to my friends that are also entrepreneurs. We schedule calls with each other to make sure we're, you know, being as happy, healthy, positive, and productive whether we're together or with our friends or our business and our families, we're keeping our spirits high because business is looking very different for all of us right now. The hustle is real. The hustle is hard and we're all emotional. We're frustrated. We're feeling defeated, but we are not quitting. So don't you quit. And that's why I titled this episode, Don't Quit, because you just can't. You've got to pivot. I've pivoted my brand so many times. I pivoted when I was sick. I pivoted during the pandemic. I pivoted after the pandemic. I've pivoted recently, which I'm so excited to share so many announcements with you. And first of all, thank you so much for tuning in. I really appreciate your time. So I'm going to make this episode as short as possible. I have two pages of notes in front of me, but as we know, I talk fast and I want to get straight to the point. So... Going back to feeling emotional, frustrated, and defeated, how do I get out of those ruts? I walk, I talk, and I step up my morning and evening routines. So if you want to know what I do every single morning, I try really hard to wake up as like early as I possibly can. I like to set my alarm for like 6, 6, 10. I 
try so hard not to hit snooze. Usually I get up earlier than that, believe it or not. But I do sound baths. I sleep to a sound bath, which I'll get into my evening routine with you in a second. But sound baths have been critical in my healing journey. I mean, I have not slept, not have slept with a sound bath in, I can't even count on one hand, I don't think. I do it almost every single night. And I do it in the morning as well. I have been a huge fan of Susie, who goes by the Copper Vessel. Look her up. She's been on the show as well. She's incredible. She's a sound healer. And sound healing is basically music frequency. And I might be saying this wrong, but it's healing through sound. And it has done wonders for my anxiety, my depression, my PTSD, and just my overall healing journey, period. I'm also down 30-something pounds, by the way, which I'm so proud of myself for, but I'm telling you, walk, walk and talk, do your hot girl walks. You won't regret it. So going back to my morning routine, I'm waking up earlier. I'm doing more sound baths. I have my legs on the wall doing my stretching. I'm hydrating more. All of my videos with my homemade electrolytes have been going viral on TikTok and YouTube. It's so crazy. I'm like, how come my podcast videos can't go viral? I'm talking about water and that shit goes viral. Another video also with an ocean background, like a Taylor Swift audio I did about my healing journey. It has almost 30,000 views right now. I think that's like the most I've ever gotten, which is so weird. So you can check that out on YouTube. But going back again to my morning routine, oil pulling, which is so good because I haven't been to the dentist in a while. And... um that helps with pain and removing bacteria and the whitening of your teeth. And I'm a huge fan. Obviously, ice rolling. If you've been following me for a while, you know that I've been using my Skinny Confidential Ice Roller. They just announced they're on Amazon now. All of their products. So that's pretty amazing for them. And my lymphatic massage in the morning. And sometimes I do it at night if I'm extra puffy. But you really got to open the, those lymphs so that you can start the drainage. And it's great to remove toxins and puffiness and all of that. And I'm diving back into reading. I just reread my book because I have an exciting announcement to share with you shortly. But every now and then I need to like reread my own content so I can be the best version of myself for you and the people listening to the show and people following me online. And I just think it's really important to, you know, reverse it and just streamline and see like what's working for me or what's not working for me in your personal life or professional life. So I've been doing a lot of that during this two-month hiatus of taking a break from the show once again. Something else that you'll see, speaking of which, is Less Is More, my new vibe, over on my website. So if you go to kellyangorman.com, you'll see a lot is missing. I just don't need it right now. And you'll see exactly what is available when it comes to personal growth, productivity, podcasting, and so much more. I've been spending a lot of time on YouTube, which I mentioned earlier. These crazy videos are going viral. I'm like, why do we have to, as content creators, do these stupid trending audios just to get the views, to get the eyeballs on our content, to then have people see what we really, truly are passionate about? It's just nuts. Anyway, if you are a content creator like me, I would love to hear your thoughts on that. Just shoot me a message on Instagram or TikTok, like seriously, anytime. <clears throat> and um, there's the first throat clearing for you. I forgot my water and my tissues, so that's where we're at. But I'm recording, and that is more important. So also, what I've been doing over my two-month break is working really hard on developing podcasts for my clients. Two of them just launched, and I'm so proud of them. One's for a big beauty brand, and another one is a life coach. And business, like I said, is just different. And so what I've been doing lately is Monday through Friday. No, today's Friday. Monday through Thursday, I opened up my calendar for coaching calls from the hours of 10 to 2 Pacific Standard Time. So if you want to work with me, if you want to pick my brain, that is when we can hang out together. You want me to help you organize your pantry. You need to get rid of clothes and you need a sidekick while, while you're doing the laundry and like reorganizing. Like I'm your girl. I do it all. And I'm also a full-blown Gemini, so if you know anybody like this, then you'll understand where I'm coming from. Nothing I do is normal. It's always over the top. I do a lot of things when it comes to 
organizing and productivity. And I just want to share everything that I know with you. So if that is something or service that you need or a friend needs, the best news is that it's only $97 right now instead of the regular 300 because I really just want to help as many people as I can. If you need 90 minutes, no worries. Like I usually go over my call time anyway because I like to over deliver. And I wanted to drop the price. I did it last month, I think. And I'm like, I'm just going to do it through the whole month of May so that I can, you know, offer a lower price point to those that need it and just honestly help more people. So that's what I've been doing Monday through Friday, like 10 to 2-ish. And I'm also on duty with my friend's three-month-old. So I have a, a new assistant. If you follow my Instagram stories, you may have met him already. I know that everybody that I'm on my calls with during the week have definitely met him. Anna's maybe three or four-year-old sister. Um, <coughs> there's a second throat clearing. Sorry. Sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, but yeah, so that's what I've been up to, upping my game when it comes to my morning and evening routine. I'll share my evening routine with you shortly. Well, I'll share it with you now. But I've been just working and promoting different things that I'm really passionate about lowering price points so that I can serve more of you and just trying to heal, like just trying to feel better. And I'm in Las Vegas currently, so it's definitely hot. I do not have the air conditioning on the vehicle I'm sitting in, which is why I'm also going to make this a short and sweet episode. I didn't think about that when I came out to record and it's almost noon. So it's definitely hot in here. Um, cue that song. So evening routine, lighting, my oil diffuser, scents. I have a red light. I have purple light. I have my pink Himalayan salt lamp. I have my sound baths I listen to every night. I have my water, my tea, my alcohol, my Netflix, whatever it is, whatever you need, just fucking do it. I'm trying to read more and that's just what I'm doing for me, my evening routine. My morning routine is honestly more important to me, but again, the evening routine is also important because I need to set myself up for a successful morning. If I don't go to bed at a certain time or if I don't do my sound bath to sleep, which I didn't last night until three in the morning, I was up tossing and turning while well, I actually had cramps. And then I was like, what is going on? And then I put my sound bath, then I was out cold, then I woke up and I was fine. But I felt a little off. So I need to spend more time on my walk, more time journaling, more time meditating to make up for that. That's just me. That's how my mind and body work. So I'm sharing it with you. So if that happens to you, then maybe that will help. So I also want to stop and share that, you know, May is Mental Health Awareness Month. And I've always been vocal about struggling with my personal struggles with anxiety, depression, PTSD, all of which I had never had until I was misdiagnosed and got from all the drugs and the chemo and the, um, what do you call it? Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? When you come off meds, oh my God, I can't think of the word. Anyway, you know what I mean. So when I stopped taking all these drugs, um, this is what happened. So there's that. And I've been stressed because I'm like, business is hard lately. You know, with these algorithms, like I don't pay for any ads. I have an affiliate program, which by the way, if you want to sign up for that, it's totally free. And you actually make money when you share my content and somebody signs up, you automatically earn 10% commission. So I'll leave that in the show notes for you and all, more information on that. Maybe I'll do like a little short episode on that because a lot of people get confused and think it's like an MLM. I'm like, no, it's literally like if you share my website with a friend and they sign up for like a call or a service, you autom- automatically make 10% commission. Like as soon as they pay me, I pay you. Like that's literally it. No strings attached. Like it's just a thank you. And I started doing this back in 2017 when I launched my podcast development company because everybody was referring me to somebody that they knew. So I was like, oh my God, like I don't have to pay for ads. This is amazing. So that's how that all started. But friendly reminder, please check the show notes for today's sponsors, Get Upside App, Repurpose.io, and Fetch Rewards because if you are looking to save money on gas going out to the restaurants, you want to repurpose your content everywhere, basically get like a free virtual assistant and make money for shopping everywhere. These three tools are what you need in your business and life today. You will not regret it. And if you have any questions on how they work, just let me know. I'm an open book. I will share. I'll literally text you a video if you get confused, but why not save time, money, and energy today? by using these three tools. I've been using them for years. I love saving money. I learned, I love getting free gift cards. 
I love going to amazon.com to buy free shit. I love it. I love repurposing my content so that other people can see it on other platforms with a click of a button that's already set up for you. I could go on and on. So anyway, make sure you check the show notes for today's sponsors because I'm obsessed with them and things that I'm obsessed with, I always make sure that I share with you. So speaking of business has been difficult, the hustle is hard, the hustle is real, you know, everybody's pivoting and I am the queen of pivoting and there's all this AI information, there's all this chat GPT information and we've got to utilize these tools, we've got to learn. So are you ready for my big announcement? Are you ready? Are you ready? Are you ready? As I flip the page, there is something happening very, very soon, which is why I reread my book and it's titled everything is messy, a powerful leadership course for creative CEOs. If that's you, you are going to effing I'm going to say fucking love this course. I'm sorry if your kids are around, but there's a big fat E for explicit on the show for a reason. You are going to fucking love this course. I am creating this with a great friend of mine who is a freaking genius. And I love her. If you're listening, I love you. Thank you so much. And if you are into getting organized, if you're ready to put in the work, if you are ready to enjoy the little things in life and embrace the change, take control, know that the possibilities are endless Know that you deserve it all. Know that you should fuck the fear. That's what I'm doing now by creating something like this. Knowing that you always need to create and execute a plan. If you're ready to accept who you are and you know that quitting is never an option, this course is for you and it's almost here. I've never done something like this. The way that it's formatted, the way that it's getting built, the way that I'm launching it. The time is now for anything that you want to create. And luckily my partner in crime is fucking amazing when it comes to shit like this. And she is releasing something as well, but I should have probably asked her if I should announce hers yet, but I'll do a whole nother episode once we officially launch because you need to join her as well, because what she has in her brain and releases to the world. And when it comes to healing and trauma and business and design and just like so much more, let me just give you four words hypnosis, wealth, power, embodiment. If you connect, you feel aligned with this type of verbiage. You are going to die when you see what she has to offer. So we're doing stuff um, together because our brains think alike and our brains don't think alike and joining forces with some, something like this and releasing it to the world. It had to happen. We're utilizing tools that are brand new that everybody should be working with, in my opinion, because you're, you're missing out. And if you don't pivot to the AI, you don't pivot to the chat GPT, like you're, you're missing out. So everything is messy. A powerful leadership course for creative CEOs. This is for you. It's how it's going to show you how to move to the levels of being a creative, multi-passionate CEO with resilience reality and personal power. Sound familiar? Because I literally just read you the titles of the chapters from my book, which by the way is on sale. The ebook is 10 bucks today. Link in the show notes. I might've said link in bio earlier, but you know what I meant? Link in the show notes for everything I'm talking about today. And the book bundle, which I have two left, you get the signed copy of Everything Messy, you get productivity and business tools, finance tools, you, um, did I just say the digital version is included, and also self-care products, and so much more. So that's only 40 bucks. The book is signed. It gets sent to you. You just give me your, your address after you've paid. So that's 40 bucks. If you just want the ebook so you could dive in hard now, it's literally $10. That's it. All the links will be in the show notes. I think I did say bio earlier. But again, you know what I meant. So don't quit. Moral of the story. Don't fucking quit. Because if I'm not quitting, you can't quit either. And if you want to quit, you need to get on a call with me so that you don't quit. So I hope that you enjoyed that poem earlier. I hope that you're excited as much as I am for this brand new course coming out. If you are looking to get more organized so that you can become the most productive version of yourself, whether that is in business and life. Now is the time to work with me. The calls are only $97. They're going up June 1st, back to the 300. 
and you will be hearing from guests so soon on the show because I've officially 181 pitches that I'm slowly going through. That's something else I've been working on over the last two months um, because I need to get the best guests that you want to hear from. If you would like to become a guest or if you have a product brand or service you would like to share on the show, message me ASAP because I would love to share something with you. But again, do not quit. Know that you are not alone. Share this episode with somebody that you think may need to hear it. More importantly, if you enjoyed this show, if you've enjoyed any of the content I've ever produced on this um, podcast, please head over to Apple Podcasts right now. Rate, review, and subscribe. Your reviews mean so much to me. We are about to hit a major milestone with the show. I'm hoping I'll do it by my birthday, June 10th, which is the official six-year anniversary of the Kellyanne Cares podcast. We are in, I think, 95 or 96 countries as of today, and I could not be more grateful. Thank you for allowing me the time to take off from this show because every girl needs a break. Speaking of break, I need a water break. I'm sweating in this car, but I haven't been to the sun in a while, so it's like the same, right? Anyway, I miss you so much. If you, again, have any spare seconds of your day, let me know that you listen to this show. You can tag me on TikTok, on Instagram, on YouTube, Facebook, wherever. Let me know what you thought, but more importantly, head to Apple Podcasts right now to leave me a review. And if you screenshot and tag me, I have an amazing gift for you. Free. Totally. You know, like, no strings attached. I'll give you a copy of my book. How's that? So you don't even have to buy it. So don't quit. Don't ever quit. This is what I tell myself every fucking day. Before, during, and after, I have calls with other inspiring and motivating entrepreneurs because we're all, like, doing this shit together. We are so passionate about what we do, we're like, we can't quit. You know, we just have to pivot. So that's what entrepreneurship is all about. So if you're feeling stru- uh, like stuck, you're struggling, you want to give up, it's time to pivot and you need a break. And that's what I did. So now I'm back. I have a course. I have new calls. I have so much shit to offer you that if you could tell my voice, I'm so excited about. And I'm more excited about recording for you right now because, well, I'm about to hit uh, pause because I, like I said, need a water break, but I'm just so grateful that I get to do what I love every single day. And it's because of you that I get to do that. And thank God these windows are tinted because people keep driving by and I'm like, can they see me or not? Anyway, um, this car is hot. Anyway, I missed you. I'm glad I'm back. Stay tuned. There's so much more to come. Check the show notes for everything that I mentioned, like today's sponsors, the Get Upside app, Repurpose.io, and Fetch Rewards. It's time to save yourself time, money, and energy. Don't miss out on these deals. If you have a question about anything, you know where to find me. But again, check the show notes for every single thing that I discussed today. And don't quit. Talk to you soon. Thanks so much for tuning in to Kellyanne Cares, a one-of-a-kind show created to motivate, stimulate, educate, and inspire you. And I hope that happened for you today. As I mentioned in the intro, I would love your feedback on today's episode. Head to Apple Podcasts, YouTube, or your favorite podcast app to leave a review for the show. I would truly appreciate it. For more information on myself, the show, my book, and the programs, products, and services I've created, visit KellyanneGorman.com. While you're there, be sure to sign up for my weekly newsletter, join the podcast community, and check out the brands I'm currently loving. Let's continue today's conversation. You can connect with me on Instagram, TikTok, and Facebook at Kellyanne Gorman Official. All my other social handles will be available for you in the show notes. If you have a product, brand, story, or service you would like to share on the show, send me a message on KellyanneGorman.com today. As always, thanks for listening, sharing, and reviewing. I wouldn't be here without you, and I'm so grateful I get to do what I love each and every day. Wishing you a happy, healthy, positive, and productive day, and I'll talk to you again soon.